Hey, what's up YouTube? I'm ARB and this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to map your MIDI controller to uh, Massive X. I couldn't find any tutorials on YouTube for this, so I'm like, hey, why not just go ahead and make one? Um, you know, I had to go into the manual and figure it out, but I did, so I did all the hard work for you. So hopefully I can save you guys some time here. Um, so in this beat I was making, I need to map my frequency knob here to um, one of the knobs on my MIDI controller. So I can uh, get that, give that bass some extra flavor. Um, yeah, because the touch pad just is not, or the track pad just is not doing it for me. So what I have to do is map this knob here to one of these 16 macro controls. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on the number five here, and then you just click on whichever um, knob or one of these little boxes that you want to map. In this case, we're gonna click it onto the frequency knob. And then now my frequency and my macro control five has been mapped together. Um, so we're gonna double click this, change the name uh, MIDI Learn, stay organized. Um, and then the trick is that you actually have to map this knob to your controller by using your host. So exit out of this, and um, I'm just gonna click on this arrow right here. And then you can see right here we have um, macro knob number five set to MIDI learn um, and then you just map it like you would map anything else in Ableton control M click on this um, twist the knob that you want to map on your MIDI controller if you want to adjust your parameters just click and drag here um, in this case I don't control M and um, like that it's done as you can see that um, little fader is moving and um, and here you can see I'm twisting the knob on my controller and the frequency and macro control number five is moving. So that's it guys. Um, pretty basic, pretty simple. Um, if you guys have any questions, if you have any comments, please leave them below. Um, please leave a like, please subscribe. And once again, I'm AR Beats and thank you for watching this video.